So thanks, Bella and Maya, for talking to me today about um, your experiences in Year 9 with a device in your hands. Um, my first question is, how do you feel that having a device has helped you with your learning this year? Um, it's helped me a lot because I can look at the criteria that you guys send us and I, when I'm doing my assessments I can go through my work and base it on the criteria that I want to get. So then I'm not just thinking that I've got enough and then you guys go and mark it and then it's only at an achieved level when I'd like it to be an excellence level. Yeah, I quite like it because um, it's not messy, like everything's there and you can just refer back to it whenever you need to, like even at home and um, you don't have to always ask the teacher, you can just email the teacher as well. Do you have any questions? It helps your spelling a lot because then you could either learn new words or learn how to spell new words from the correction. Well, it was really good because it's helped with my spelling because you can just see where you need to work on it. And um, I'm better at typing than writing down with a pen and you can just get your ideas down quicker. Yeah, I think the main thing it helps with is editing, although I um, normally use paper for just coming up with that. My, my plan because I think it's a bit more versatile in that respect but um, it's a, a computer is very very useful for editing because you can have uh, your text written up and you can change small bits so you can fiddle around with it and you don't have to cross out stuff and um, get all these new pieces of paper floating around and you can sort of eat, compare how things sound you can quickly change something or say it does, does this sound any better or is it does it, does it communicate my idea clearer and if it doesn't you can switch back or and you don't have to, um, it's, a, it's a whole lot more clarity in the editing, so you don't have to have all this mess around cluttering up your thoughts. You can just have what's in front of you and you can change that and experiment with it quite easily. Um, one of the key shifts I've noted as a teacher is that I'm able to send out the information directly kind of into your drive. Do you think yeah. that's helping you with your learning? Yeah, yeah. it's much more organised because you have different folders for different subjects and um, when you send it, it just goes in there and you know where to find everything. Um, probably the most useful thing is the Google Drive function um, where you can get all the um, resources that the teacher has, has, has that they can just put it in the, in the Google Drive folder for the class and, and you, I can go and log into my Google Drive account and just see it. So I've got all the resources available to me and it's if I lose it, I can have a look at it just have a look at the thing on the drive again or if um, I if the teacher wants us to have a look at something they can just put it on the drive and doesn't have to hand out paper have, have handouts and all that kind of thing so um, I found it very useful I found it very organized um, and it's just a whole lot easier instead of managing a whole lot of papers just to use the Google Drive. The other thing I wanted to ask you about was um, our use of KMAR, which is our student management system, where you can see your results and things online. How often do you go on KMAR to have a look? Maybe once every two weeks. Right, so you're in there quite regularly just keeping up with your results. Yeah, keeping up with the results that I have and checking mm. the timetable if it has changed and the notices if there's mm. anything that I need to know about. Yeah, yeah. yeah great. Self-directed learning, I think that, that has a big part in it. Having a device, um, it's 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 good to it's faster to research things, and it helps you out real good because you could just switch tabs, and there's just something about it that makes me want to put something into there, whether I'm a piece of paper, I uh, I don't know, I just lose interest. It's unlimited really, it just fills you with ideas, and if you find something you're really interested in, then pop it into your device.